headed to the gym. But Bennett is in a meeting until we start working out. Evan is picking up his car or something like that. So I have to carry all the stuff by myself. I know, horrible. But don't worry, we're making it work. We're gonna get a super nice workout in today. It's actually, uh, so in my programs, I program in, every once in a while I like to break up the monotony of you know certain things. And monotony, while it sounds bad, is definitely very important when it comes to working out. And so that's because the number one indicator of progression is progressive overload. So either doing more weight than you've ever done before at the same number of reps, or you know adding a rep so that you're doing more volume than you've done before. So both of those are ways that you can progressively overload your workouts. But a lot of people think like, oh, Doing the same thing over and over again is boring. Well, it's necessary because that's the only way you can progress on lifts is to do them over and over again. But, you know, to break up the monotony and still, you know, allow people to progressively overload on their exercises, one of the things that I do is I program in special weeks throughout the program. So it's like every four to six weeks we'll have some specialized week. So right now what I'm having my clients and myself do is athlete week. Athlete week is where we focus on functional training, power, so like Olympic lifts and stuff like that. And we try to do things as explosively as we possibly can. And so we're gonna be going through that. You'll all get to see what that looks like. And uh, we'll finish out with horse because it is a Friday. semester break today so no classes um, so I'm hoping that the gym will be pretty empty because as you know we like to use all the space on Fridays so uh, we are almost there and we'll see what it looks like gentleman asked me to join in on a game of basketball so why not basketball is not my sport we lost by two points it's very sad about that but on to the workout
is Friday, so that means that we're playing horse. So how that works is just like in basketball, you shoot from a certain spot, if you hit it, and other people miss from that same spot, then they get a letter. We're just doing that with calisthenic movements. So let's hop right in. I'm gonna try to do a muscle up. Nope. I'm gonna do a muscle up. <laughs> Yeah, boy. <laughs> the last two survivors, everyone else has long since gotten their E and walked home. We're gonna call it a tie. Just got a great workout in, and we are about to head to the mall. Ben needs to shop for a new hoodie, and I need to get my skincare stuff. Bro, my fucking arms look good. <laughs> back on that progressive overload train I was talking about earlier. The reason why we do athlete week or some variation of athlete week probably like once every four to six weeks is because you got to keep in mind the principle of specificity which is just a fancy way of saying like you need to train for what your goal is 
And so you have to do the things that lead to that. So part of Sub7 Fitness's mission is to help people to be strong and athletic and functional, not just to be, you know, big bodybuilders or, you know, all puffy and like mass monster and stuff like that. Um, and so that's why we do it, you know, we sprinkle it in, but you got to make sure that you're training for your goals. And for most of the people I train and, you know, kind of like what we specialize in is building that Hollywood physique. And so you can't only train like functional training, like sled pushes, like all the stuff that you saw earlier, but you also don't want to just do, you know, like three sets of 12 or something like that because you'll end up not really gaining anything, you know? You gotta vary your training, but you also need to train specifically for your goal. And the most important thing is progressive overload. So you always wanna be improving on your lifts. You always wanna be pushing for those PRs. You wanna make sure that you are getting stronger. And as a result of that, you will build the body of your dreams as long as you're eating properly as well. So Justina just pointed this out. But the bandana apparently was too tight because I got these ugly ass red lines on my forehead now. Do I have that also? <laughs> nah, you're good. Cool. Yeah. I look like. <laughs> Wait, you kind of do right here. Right here. Oh, shit. Right there. Yep. Fuck. We're both Harry Potter now. Confirmed. Destination H and M for Bennett. Don't you want one of those? Oh shit! I do want one of these. Oh, that looks nice. No, it's just the lens is strong. I'm still gonna try this one. All right, let me know in the comments, should Bennett get green or gray? The head's so small. I like the gray, but I also like the green. One of the employees walked up, like we started talking about camera stuff and like what I'm shooting with and what he shoots with and he ended up giving me a promo code to get this thing that I really want for a discounted price with free shipping and everything. So, shout out to H&M. Customer service is great. We got lost. So, Justine is checking out the directory right now. Bennett wore his hoodie out of the store because he's feeling the drip. Probably gonna get some food after we buy some skincare stuff and then head out and watch the sunset. Bennett's feeling the Philly cheesesteaks. Cena and I are not really trying to do that. And nothing else in here really looks good, so. We're probably gonna get food somewhere else. I don't know where they He finished his food before we even got ours. Uh, I'm gonna do the edgy Asian, the, the edgy. <laughs> yes, rock it. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Got our pizza. Bennett ate his chili. 
Huh? Philly cheesesteak. <laughs> Damn, I really forgot what it was called. <laughs> uh, so I think we're gonna call this the vlog. We're about to just kick it at Bennett's apartment. Um, probably drinking some stuff like that. Eat our pizzas, hit our calories and our macros. If you like the video, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the notification bells so you never miss out on the info you need to build the body of your dreams with a lifestyle you enjoy. Peace.